delegation of Norway. Thank you, His Excellency. Uh, Norway would like to express our appreciation to the President that the preparatory process has formally and finally started with this first consultation initiated here today and in line with GA Resolution 66-296. We welcome the appointment also of the four advisors to the process and we would like them we would like to thank them for taking the time to this important responsibility and we would like to express our appreciation to see all of the four here today. Let me reiterate what we stated at the last day of the Permanent Forum on Indigenous People. We support the roadmap put forward on the 19th of May. The roadmap represents a compromise. It ensures the full and effective participation of Indigenous people in accordance with Resolution 66-296 and it also addresses the concerns that some member states had put forward. Let me be clear, it states that the first stages of the drafting and consultation will be carried out with member states and indigenous peoples, but that the final stage will be member states only. Mr. Chair, Resolution 66, uh, 65-198 states that the conference should be held in order to share perspectives and best practices on the realization of the rights of indigenous peoples, including to pursue the objectives of the United Nations Declaration on the Rights of Indigenous Peoples. For Norway, as a party to the ILO Convention 169, it is important to secure the full and effective participation of indigenous peoples at the national level through their representative institutions in decision-making processes at all levels of society, whenever, wherever consideration is being given to legislative or administrative measures which may affect them directly. The involvement of indigenous peoples representatives in the international preparatory process to the conference and in the negotiations leading to a concise action-oriented document is of fundamental importance. We have actively supported the indigenous people's preparatory process leading up to the ALTA uh, document. This document represents the priorities of the indigenous peoples and it is indeed an important input to the process that starts here today. I would just like to align ourselves to my Danish colleague who has just said that there will be an expert meeting next week in Copenhagen to, to discuss among the Nordic countries and governments and indigenous peoples on the possible concrete elements for the outcome document. But just to say, Norway is ready to be involved in the process and we look forward to seeing a first draft of the outcome document soon, uh, which will take into account the elements that is within the framework of Resolution 66296. I thank you, Mr. Chair.